Hey guys, Michelle's Mobile Media here. The following videos are going to be dedicated to San Joaquin Valley Transparency and his crew. Just want to say thank you very much. I appreciate everything you guys have done for me and my channel. Y'all have a good day. Bye. Alright. We got a DUI stop. Oh, we got Copeland over there again. He just read in his rights. Anything you say can and will be used against you. We've got 622 right here. That's how they are. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, it's, I, my son was standing there. He yelled at him, you can go. I mean, it's unnecessary. You can stand where you want. There, there, there is, there's no restrictions where you can I don't even know stand. what's going on. Like It looks like they're doing a DWI test on you. Kayla, calm down. Just calm down. Yeah, she definitely does not need to talk to the police officers now that she's been arrested. Yeah, she needs to stay quiet. She won't need to answer any questions. They're going to search her car? I don't know. Kayla? This car, I rent this car on Turo because my car is in the shop and I couldn't find it. I, and it may be in there. I don't know. I'm such a nervous wreck. He said, for you. You're going to get a ticket. For what? Because I'm driving a Turo car and I don't know where the entrance And it may be in there. I, I'm just so nervous. I don't feel like anytime you can always pull up insurance. I left out of my house. I don't even have my phone. Is there somebody else in that car? I don't think so. She was probably by herself. I'm not sure if she was coming from work. I don't know. Like I said, I was asleep. And she called you? Yeah, there was somebody else in there. It is? Yeah, it looks like there's somebody else in that car. Uh -huh. We, we do I need this. A phone. I need to um pull up mine because he's telling me my driver's license is suspended, and I know that Did it's you? not. I haven't had a ticket or anything for my license to be suspended. Oh, that's a little boy. <laughs> that's a little young kid. Is that my grandson? Yeah, I don't know. There's somebody in that car though. I wonder if it's my grandson. This is my grandson. So we've got Denim Springs 482, Denim Springs 622, and would you take a look at that? Oh. That's that's what's gonna get her in trouble. She keeps talking to the
It sure did look like somebody was in there. I don't want to talk and I just want her to be quiet. She don't need okay. to say, say nothing to nobody. Do you need me to show you how to get back to your car? Oh, uh, seriously? Yes, oh, we can, seriously? we can sit in that one. Yeah. Are you threatening to put your hands on me and physically throw me in a car? Is that what you're saying? Car. That'd be a bad mistake on him. But, but what am I doing? Anything not, that you're, I need you're to be doing to get in what, my what car? What you're doing is called freedom of speech. You're allowed I, to I don't talk. Get it. You're allowed to talk. You it's can talk allowed. all you it's want to. Don't let her tell you it's can't allowed, talk. Right? Yeah. It's allowed. No, it's not. There is. It's not. Yeah. I promise you it's not. Okay. You're allowed to talk anytime you want to. It's freedom of speech. It's your First Amendment. They just try to bully you around is all they're trying to do right now. I think they're going to wrap it up. Okay, you notice they're not telling us to back up, right? You oh, notice no. That, right? Of course not. Here you go, ma'am. Your, your daughter. Ma'am. Your daughter wants to give you a Yeah, look how young this boy is. Little baby. And it don't look like he's got his own vehicle. So he must be riding with somebody. Uh, I think she failed a DUI test because when we were walking up on her, she was kind of, she was doing um, the field sobriety test and I think she failed. And of course, that's mama down there. She's pissed off, which any mama would be. Excuse me. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> oh, I was getting a little feisty. A little feisty. I don't want to see anybody get hurt. I don't want to see anybody get arrested. I don't want to see mama go to jail. I don't want to see daughter go to jail. Oh, she flipped a bitch right there. Huh? She flipped a bitch right there. Oh. Illegal U-turn or something. And of course we got Copeland right here. In the middle. Not that one. See, they, 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 they're pushing people around that don't know their rights. I know, they didn't say nothing to us. And that's why I brought it up, even knows where we're at. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're big. trying to let somebody come get the car. Asking who else has a driver's license. Yeah. Well, at least they're allowing her to keep her car. But have you noticed they're asking for somebody with a driver's license? So they're going to try to ID somebody before they let them take the car. Yeah. And you do not have to give ID. Anybody can drive anybody's car. You do not have well, to Well, do they actually have to, to you... drive somebody else's car? If it was in their driveway, the cops are not going to, you know... Do they actually driveway. have to run your driver's license, or can you just show them your driver's oh, no, license? They're, they're, they're going to run. I mean, they're, they're, they're gonna, See? I don't... I mean, yeah, they're going to run it. They're going to make sure you have no warrants or anything like that. Yeah. But it's officer discretion. You know, either give us your ID to drive this car home, or we're going to tow it. Yeah. That's what they do. But in reality, you don't have to give up your ID to drive somebody else's car. That's just one of the things that they do to try to run you through the system. So. Yep. So whoever comes to try to get that car, if they don't give up their license.
license, they're not going to be able to drive that car. I didn't know we had that many. Hmm? I didn't know we had that many nighttime officers. Like I said, I think it might be because we do. Yeah. July Are they trying to give you a ticket? Oh, he said he's giving me a whole school ticket. For what? <laughs> but he didn't pull you over. No, I pulled up to check on my daughter. He said license is dropped. I think I had to give my driver's license you... registration. I'm not being detained or stopped. No, I mean, you didn't, you didn't do nothing wrong, did you? No. Then you might have to give up your ID. Kind of. She made an illegal U turn right there. That's probably why they want to mess with you. A whole slew of tickets. Copeland's on a roll today, huh? Oh, yeah. And always remember that if you don't, if you didn't break any laws, you don't have to ID. Right. But, you know, like I said, I don't know what the, they're trying I didn't to give him my ID. Away. I told him my name was the first thing. I'm like, I'm, like, I'm not providing you with anything. Yeah. yeah. Well, well, you're trying to take care of your daughter and her father. No, I just yeah, wanted to come it. and see what was going on. I was asleep. But see, my they, son came and said, Taylor hey, said, I was like, wait a minute, let me oh. get dressed. So he left out to come and see. Well, that's why we're out here to make sure these cops stay in their place. Right. Make sure she's safe. Yeah. I appreciate you guys. Oh, we, 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 this is heartfelt for us. Yeah. I was worried about her coming here. I was like, oh my gosh, let me hurry up. Yeah, I I saw him come up behind you. I really he thought he was going to put his hands on you. Sometimes. I'm trying to tell you not to talk. You can speak all you want to. Yeah. That is, that is your right. Yeah. You can speak all you want to. So this guy is still here. But they are trying to let her get somebody to drive that car away so they don't have to tow it. My son had a car. He didn't let him. He said, you can leave. Uh, he told him to leave. Was he in the car? He, yeah, he, he pulled up first. My son oh. was standing oh, there. Oh, he was the one that was parked up here. Oh, right. okay. And he was like, you can leave. You can just get If your mom's here, you can go. And he was like, when my sister called me, he was like, no, you leave now. Oh. <laughs> like, okay. So I was like, is your rudeness necessary? That's what I asked him. Like, is your rudeness necessary? And that's what he got upset with me. Like, me. This is the traffic stop. Really? I don't see a barbecue pit. <laughs> oh, man. I don't see a barbecue pit, so how are we making it a family business? Like, wow. Well, I think it's a good thing. Yeah. yeah. That, that was incredibly rude. I don't... I flash. I flash on shit like that. That would not go over well I'm trying not to. Right. But they sh they should be professional about all of this. They work for right. us. They should be Hmm. Made him leave, but not us. Okay.
Bit. Babylon Babin decided, oh hell no, there is Daniel and Michelle. I am not stopping. Y'all just gonna have to deal with it yourselves. I can't stand those two. <laughs> right? You know that's what he said. What? Are we having a party? Hmm? Well. Sure am. Well, I don't know if they're going to let her take that car home or not. It's been going on longer than 20 minutes. Definitely got a little hectic for a minute there. I don't think we've ever been to this guy. Got some more sirens going on out there. Probably an ambulance.
into me, do it, I think. <laughs> There's some more sirens down there. Turn down Hatchel Lane. The Cochran. Turn down Cochran Lane. Whoa. <sighs> Huh? Really? I bet you a million bucks having one of those two. The was, yeah, one of those two was Babin. I bet you said, "Oh hell no, that's Daniel and Michelle." <laughs> <laughs> They know what's They know. They know what's I'm not trying to say she's not wrong. I, I mean, I just have no idea of what happened. Because when we, she when, when we walked over there, it looked like they were doing the DWI. Yeah, they. They think she's yeah. been drinking. She, she was. She was. She did go hang out with some friends. Okay. I don't know. But they treated you unprofessionally. Yes, you're, very. You're a worried mother about what's going on. They should not be, you know, that, that is what we call escalation. Yeah. Stay. See, I don't want to have to say it. I'm just going to go I let it. I, mean, I just don't, you know what I mean? I, if they start nipping. I'm grown. I'm grown. I'm allowed to smoke. I'm grown. I hope they say something about it. I don't think you will. I'm not going to argue. You can go to court. 
because I can be, and I will be there. And none of this is going to so think. So I. you're just trying to give me a hard time. So I will bring everything that I need to bring. Perfect. Cars insurance does not expire. It doesn't go away. It will show that it was insured at the time of this non-traffic stop of a word parent trying to check on her daughter. All of it is in my phone. That sounds like retaliation. He's just, I, I don't know. He so where's your phone? My son's about to pull up here and give it to me because I rushed out of the house because so, I was told so my daughter. So you don't have it. proof of insurance with you in the vehicle for Louisiana State Law? That's not okay, my cool. vehicle. All right, okay. But I know it's insured. Is your sign right there for me? It's not an admission of guilt. It's acknowledging that you'll uh, show up for court or take care of the fine before the court date. You can admit it. I refuse to sign. Okay, you can sign it or you can get arrested for this charge. Okay, they, you have to sign it or they've got to take it in front of the magistrate. You have to sign it. Or they can't take so the That is one thing he is actually right about. These tickets, is, it's just a written promise that you'll show up to court or pay Oh, the I will definitely go to court because none of this is kind of sick. Because if you don't sign it, they have to take you in front of the magistrate. And then okay. it goes from there. Ah, fine. That's about the only thing he's right on so far. <laughs> He's listening. He's got his window cracked. He's listening. You should just go ahead and get out. You should go ahead and get out. <clears throat> and join your co worker. <clears throat> Poor honey. I'm sorry you got three tickets. You gotta be careful, guys. And then when you get all your fines paid off, which is what you like to send it for, then you can take it to the B&B and get your license back. Okay. Your son right here at the bottom for me. You said your son's coming up here? Mm -hmm. Perfect. And he can give you a ride home because you're not legally allowed to drive. Good copy of that thing. Alright. Now, if you don't mind, we can drop this car home for me. Oh, I'm Got concerned it. about my daughter. I don't want to deal with you. That's the problem. <laughs> I need to walk away for it. So this is the only way out, but yes, I will drive that car home for you. I do have a valid driver's yeah. license. I'm um, not worried about that because if he was, he'd have made sure somebody was here with a valid driver's license. Well, let's let these guys get out of here first. Do you have keys to that car right there? Which one? The that hurts. Yeah. No? Not gonna get keys to that car? She's gonna try to get keys to her car. Nope, they're not even. Wow. Wow. <laughs>